Hi, these comments are for T.O. This is Michael. Thank you for doing your independent speaking practice test. The question you're answering here is, what is one change you'd like to make about your country? Explain why this change would be important, and then give some examples and reasons to support your point of view. All right, so I have the uh, independent speaking rubrics here right now. All right, let's see how you do. One of the several things I would like to change about my nation is uh, preventing people from stigmatizing uh, people with HIV AIDS, which is a seminar or a killer disease. Um, in Nigeria, which is my home country, people tend to run away from people or do, or do not want to associate with them simply because they, they think they can contract the disease simply by talking to them. And um, one of the things I want to like improve on is like um, improving the commercial awareness of people, letting people know that even though they contract HIV, it is something that they can be that they can be treated for. Although it doesn't have any cure right now, now people does not need to like run away from them or make them feel bad simply because they they have HIV. One of the several. Okay, so uh, I think on this one, uh, looking at the actual speaking prompts, I was thinking maybe three, but I'm probably going to go a little lower than that. Let me listen to it one more time. I, I think you have some delivery issues. There's a few words in there I couldn't quite understand, and maybe I think you're having some problems with either word choice or grammar that kind of prevents you from fully expressing your ideas. And maybe when you talk about the people running away you kind of repeat that near near the end but I would maybe come up with maybe two reasons so people should not be discriminated you know in terms of personal relationships or, or interactions because they have HIV or you might say people should also not be dis discriminated in jobs because of HIV something like that okay let's listen to uh, you respond one more time. Things I would like to change about my nation is uh, preventing people from stigmatizing. This, prevent people from something. I'm having a little bit of trouble getting that. Uh, people with HIV AIDS, which is a seminar or a killer disease. Which is a seminar that. I'm not quite getting that either. Says, um, in Nigeria, which is my home country, people tend to... Yeah, and, and then... In many cases, we want to pronounce the H, right? So it's my home country. Run away from people or do, or do not want to associate with them simply because they, they think they can contract the disease. Simply. So they think either they have contracted or they think that they contracted the disease or the HIV disease. By talking to them. And um, one of the things I want to like improve on is like um, improving the commercial awareness of people. Let's that. Improving the commercial something? People know that even though they contract HIV, it is something that they can be, that they can be treated. So even though they contracted or even though they have contracted HIV, so again, be careful of your verb tenses. You're, you tend to use the simple present, right? But you can't use that in every situation. So you need to review your verb tenses, particularly how is the simple present different from the present perfect, or how is the present perfect different from the simple past? If you go to Google, you can type in those key words to get more information. For, although it doesn't have any cure right now, now people does not need to like run away from them or make them feel bad simply because they, they have HIV. How about there's no need to not socialize with these people or discriminate against them in jobs because they have HIV or something. Uh, okay, so based on the rubrics, I think you're more in the two range than you are the three. I'm going to say around two and a half. I'm going to put you at 17 to 18 points out of 30. Uh, definitely, you have quite a few articulation or pronunciation problems uh, maybe some problems with pacing rhythm a little bit uh, also some problems with your grammar and your word choice and that's why I'm giving you the score that I am so for you spend time I know that you did the pretest I gave you feedback on that so you should be practicing 
practice a lot in the pronunciation area of my course. I think that's going to be important for you.